I remember that the leftovers were in the back seats. So, huh? so, hey, you paid for them. Them is yours. So I, that, so I had that later. Them is yours. Yeah, I was. Uh, I, I think I was like nineteen at the time. I respect it. I respect nineteen, yeah. Rashad. Yeah, yeah. I just, I, 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 I been to the it. point where I'd be like, "So what's my? I'm like, so what's my budget?" Mm. Like what? Like while we there, I'm like, so what's my budget? And if you like get whatever you want, I still be like, yeah, let me go ahead and get this chicken bowl, and I don't need no appetizer. I'm good. But see, that's just respectful. Like, mm-hmm. D.L. Hewley said it best. He was like, well, you want the steak and lobster? Well, you know, steak and lobster comes with dick. Yeah, that, <laughs> it, I learned my lesson. See, I'm, I'm just trying. <laughs> I'm just not. I'm not that person. Like, I can't be like. I can't go on a date with somebody and just be like, "Yeah, let me get the lobster tail and um the shrimp scampi and the uh you know um the appetizer, you know the calamari. Can I get that too? And I also want a margarita to drink too." All I heard was we fucking. That's all I heard. <laughs> all I heard was let's get one with you. All I heard was didn't draw. I can, all I heard was overdraft. <laughs> your car about to overdrive at the end of the night. <laughs> All I heard was I came outside with no draws on. That's all the fuck I heard. No, oh, so you, oh, so oh, okay. You giving, you giving up the whole thing? Tonight. Oh, right, yeah. okay. Hey, oh, on the first, on the first date, I knew I was that nigga. I knew I was that nigga. Go, oh, she liked me, like me. Oh, she, okay, oh yeah, she, oh she in this. Okay, we ain't, we ain't gonna beat around the bush. Mm-hmm. I, I I respect that. I respect that because that's all I heard. Yeah, that's, that's all crazy. this conversation is all this conversation has not been for not you okay hmm. like excuse me waitress uh mattress please <laughs> yeah mattress, yeah please. mattress please <laughs> <laughs> please just go ahead to your fine your finest <laughs> your, your your finest warehouse thank you your fine yeah. your finest storeroom if you would you know, like, warehouse? Need, I need yes. a fresh batch of your finest cheddar cheese biscuits. Dude. <laughs> hey, my boy, I'm gonna tell you like this. That's a meal. That's a meal. But if you if you if you need to stretch it out, no, you know I'm not really hungry today. My my stomach hurt. Let me just I just eat some of the biscuits. You know, so I'm good. Good. Hey man, yeah. sometimes you gotta you gotta work your way through it. You ever yeah. went on a date for fifty dollars before? <laughs> it yes, brother. brother. That that, yes. that be them dates where you be like, well, I mean, my paycheck ain't hit yet, but we still can go get something to eat. Mm. Like that's the primary indication that we balling on the budget, and then you sit down and order the ultimate feast. <laughs> <laughs> you go to the bathroom, and I'm leaving. Well, <laughs> what was it? Uh, was it a couple months ago when old girl ordered? Was it four sets of oysters, and then? Nine drinks, and homeboy, homeboy left for the note and was like, "I holla at you." It left for the bill. Hey, bro, but that's, these, but these situations get it's so communication, out of control. Though. It's communication. It is because yeah, I'm like, really I'm like I, I would be just be like, "Hey, so what's my left and right limits?" <laughs> there, there is so <laughs> much conversation that is not being had prior to these groups of people going into these establishments, like the one where the guy took his old lady out to eat for her birthday and mm-hmm. all of her friends were there. Oh, no. no and he was like, so yeah. you're paying for all of us, right? And he was like, no, I'm paying for no. the person that I brought with me. Then, Not even. Like, then like, the waitress was can. like, <laughs> all right, bro. Better, hey, better. make sure you get a tab to her. I'm going to pay for my food, though. <laughs> and, then, and then the girl that he was paying for started acting crazy. Started chiming in like, "Oh, you say oh, so, if you oh, didn't oh, have so it. Why would you, you say you didn't have it? Oh, so you were there? Yeah, okay. Well, now, now you don't have it either. <laughs> that part. I guess y'all better chip in together. <laughs> guess y'all better go wash some dishes because um, I'm not paying for. I'm not uh, paying. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, don't don't mess with me. I'll be dancing and stuff." Yeah. Better call your man. Call Tyrone. <laughs> oh, call the other nigga. It. Call the other dude you talking to. Man, I ain't got man, time. I ain't we, got it. We live in a day and time where people cannot wait for the opportunity to call somebody broke. And it's like, I remember seeing a video. A guy was in a club. He was somewhere like big city, Miami, Chicago, Los Angeles. Somewhere. Up, huh? 
tried to order bottle service and his car declined. So they came back with the sign with I the words on it. This. He says you were broke. Oh my. And they walked it through the entire club with the sparklers. I don't believe in putting your hands on the opposite sex. <laughs> but I feel like there's a, a however a bottle a bottle to your head. Hey, not totally a bottle different. to your head. What was the uh, what was the other one where an uh, old girl rented out the bottle service and then was like pay your child support? Yeah, That's I crazy. saw that one. I saw the one where the girl got mad because the dude was paying with a cash app card. Uh, so one, you, you either mad because you don't have the amount of money that you want him to have, but two, even if he got the money, you mad at how he's spending it? Mm-hmm. Don't pay for no date with no cash app card. I'm like, but he's paying for the date. Imagine you go to a dinner and the tab is a thousand dollars and the late and, and the girl said, Nigga, are you writing a check? <laughs> <laughs> Listen. Yeah. First of all, if you write a check in twenty eight twenty four, that's wow. Hey, business. hey, hey! I I literally seen an old lady writing a check at the who, grocery who you store. Saw? Who you saw? Old lady. Exactly. Old lady. There you go. <laughs> old lady. If somebody handed you a check right now, like a live check, you'd be like, "What am I supposed to do with?" This? Listen, I work in I work in the generation retail. Oh. So this dude was trying to trying to false. So he brought in a false bank Bank of America check and was trying to use it. I was like, bro. As they declined twice, I'm like, bro, it's, it, we need something else. Let's do something else. Just use something else. 